Eden's birthday. How old are you today, Eden? I am 11 years old today. What do you think of me? Do you think I look 11 years old? Nudge. I have decided to treat Eden to a lovely wash. Eden likes a good pampering. She likes the hair dryer and she likes to be dried nicely. So I'm going to treat Eden to a nice soaky wash right now. Come on in. Yeah. Come. Just wash out. And you're going to get lots of treats today, aren't you, Eden? Come on. Here's a rabbit treat for being in the bathroom. Ooh, you like those, don't you? Gobble. Delicious. Oh my god, Dad, they like drugs. How's your leg? Looks alright, doesn't it? Just need that little scab to come off. Oh, look at this little grey eyebrows she's got now. She's got these two little grey eyebrows. Yeah, that's new this year, Dad. That's new. Put me in the box. Right. Oh my god, I'm in the box. You can just see my eyes. All right, let's begin the birthday washing. What do you think about this, Eden? Birthday washing. Like the sound of it? Oh, I do. Okay, bring this out. Whee. Make it nice and warm. Nice. Don't you look like a little seal? Yes, I do look a bit like a seal. Treat. Thank you, nice and soapy. Do you like that? I do not want it. I like being pampered. Oh my god! Making sure to give Eden a proper rinse that all the soapy is gone and she's ready for her dry. I'm done. Take me out. I'm finished with my bark. I've got these rabbit treats. They're like training treats from the UK. And Eden loves them. You love them, don't you? You know my favourite. In fact, I love them so much that I asked my mummy to bring me back some more. Okay, let's go to the Eden cupboard. This is Eden's section here. Stinky Pinky. I call this the Chloe towel because it used to be Chloe's. Okay. This is the first stage of Eden's drying. She likes to dry herself. So I just go like this. And then what I do is I move around and I dry myself. <laughs> Good girl. I don't have to do any work. Come on, let's introduce the second towel. This is stage two. Got a rub. Got a nice rub. Yeah, that's good. I love drying time. I really do love it. Thanks, Dad. We have two types of drying. We've got the mummy dry, which is Sasha's version of drying Eden, which takes not so long and leaves her slightly damp. And then there's the daddy dry, which is my version, which takes ages and makes her lovely and soft. I spoke with mummy on Skype the other day and I said, can I please request a daddy dry because it makes me nice and nice and softy. Did you hear me, dad? I've requested a daddy dry. We've got the hair dryer and the mitt over there. So it's all happening. <laughs> I'm implementing the use of the house fan to aid in the, the drip drying process of Eden in the towel drying scene. It's working dad, it's making me dryer. Mm. So for clarity's sake, this is what a mummy dry looks like. Semi dry, a little bit damp, is still a bit damp, but that's not good enough for my puppy is it? You want the full daddy treatment don't you? Alright, it's time to de-knot you. Just get all those grass seeds and knots out of your ears. I know like not many non-dog owners will understand, but it's quite nice to spend time bonding with a puppy. It feels quite therapeutic, just brushing her ears and taking some time away from work to just sit down with your dog and make them feel nice. Nice bit of therapeutic pampering for you. And at the same time, it makes you more beautiful. Okay, that's the detangling stage done. Now onto the final stage, the mitt. I bought this from like a Thailand pound shop called Daiso. It's like a 60 baht shop. Rub Eden down while you blow dry her so she gets nice and static free. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Whee! Oh my god, my hair dry is broken.
Look at that poser. All finished with your wash. This is what a daddy dry looks like. Lovely and fluffy and shiny and clean. This isn't the end of Eden's treats for the day. I'm gonna take her to the Charm Forest Park and let her off the lead. I think she deserves it. She hasn't been off lead for a very long time. So that will be nice. And then when we get back, I'm preparing Eden's favorites. I have some chicken breasts defrosting. Eden absolutely loves chicken breasts. I'm gonna give her half a chicken breast with a candle in the top. <laughs> so it's kind of like a healthy cake. It's better than putting a cake in her. So Eden, you're gonna have a chicken breast cake. What do you think of that? I have to say, I am quite excited about chicken breast cake. Happy birthday, puppy. She's showing signs of age. She's got more gray on her snout now. And she's got these little gray eyebrows. Apart from that, I think she's doing all right. Let's see how Father Superior is doing. God, I'm really hot. Very nice. Yeah? It's not so cold anymore. The sun came out in the end. Yeah. So it was uh, not too cold in the water. No. Just a minute to open a few things. I might actually do some myself. Yeah. We went to the pharmacy yesterday and got some magnesium pills. Yeah. How'd your legs feel? Not bad today. Only had one set of leg yeah, cramps yeah. in the night. Yeah. So I think the combination of the bananas and the almonds and the supplement yeah. might be doing something, doing some good. In the crunch. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> and I've been teaching my dad to do stretches at night. <laughs> there you go, good old set of lower back stretches. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna go for a swim. Right, let's do this. Once you aim, it's all right. Not bad. I thought you said you, you're not good at swimming. <laughs> no. All right, into the car we go. We're taking Eden to the forest park now. How do you feel about this, Eden? Oh, I'm very excited about my excursion to the char um, forest park, I must say. Take me. Right, it takes about 10 minutes to get there, so I'll see you there. And we are here at the park and it seems like just the right time of day. The light is nice. There's some sunlight beaming through the trees and it's reasonably cool, just a little bit humid. But let's get Eden out of the car, can't see any dogs. Hopefully she'll have a nice little run. I need to find somewhere where she can come off lead. How is it Eden? How are the smells? It's nice and quiet in here at the moment. There's not many people here at all, which is a good thing. And we're just taking a stroll onto the nature trail that I found the other day. I want to get nice and far away from the road before Eden can come off lead. I can hear some nice birds making their famous noises. We were just uh, listening to the Ooh. bird, which I haven't heard probably since Chiang Rai. <laughs> Come on. It's about 4.30 in the afternoon. It's quite a nice time to be out here. You get nice beams of sunlight coming through the trees at this time of day. Sun beaming through the trees. What do you think, either magical? She doesn't care. She's just sniffing all the sniffs. Get a nice birthday treat. <laughs> Good girl. Come on in, let's go. Come on, this way. I was just telling my dad about the gibbon that I saw here the other day. I wonder if there's going to be another one or if that was a rare sighting. We've gone off road and we're heading down the nature trail now. Don't fancy Eden jumping in that. Turned out to be quite a nice day in the end. This morning it was very cloudy, but then just when we decided to go swimming, it cleared up and it got nice and blue like this. For anybody that doesn't know, this video was filmed on Christmas Eve, so Eden's birthday is actually on Christmas Eve. We made a video about our Christmas in May Salong last year, and we had a little birthday celebration then. So if you want to see that, check it out here. It's Eden's birthday! 
She is 10 years old today. I don't like my hat. Oh no. Eden. <laughs> Christmas Eve dog. Eden. So Eden was born on Christmas Eve. She had two sisters. One was called Eve and one was called Holly. And for some reason, they called her Jess, but we renamed her to Eden. Mm -mm. Jess isn't a festive name, is it? Not at all. No. Punk. <laughs> brings back some nice memories. Okay, so we have a missile launch plan. Dad is gonna keep Eden here. I'm gonna walk down this path and I'm gonna try and get her to run to me. Let's see if she strays from the path. Okay, I think this might be far enough. All right, you ready? Eden, come. Come. Oh, you are a slow doggy. You're very slow. It's okay. How are you then? I think Eden is tired. <laughs> yeah, she didn't want to run too much. Never mind. Yeah, Dad, can you put my collar? Yeah. Can you put my collar back on, please? Yeah. You're not going to do another one, are you? I don't think she's interested that much. <laughs> Recently, Sasha and I have been a bit concerned that Eden is losing her hearing a bit. She doesn't seem to react in the ways that she used to. I've tried like clapping loudly behind her and stuff and she very rarely responds to it like you would expect a dog to. So I'm thinking to go to the vet and see if she needs her ears cleaned. Or maybe she's just going deaf in her old age, but I don't know. We're going to take the left path. Cacti. Wouldn't fancy falling into that bush. Got my eyes open for gibbons. I want to see if I can show one to my dad. I'm curious to know if it's common to see them in here or if I was just lucky the other day. Okay, we've returned to the path. Now we're going to head back towards where the car is. Do you enjoy that, Eden? Enjoy the nature trail? Come on. We are coming up on the exercise park, which means that we're almost back at the car. There's about four or five dogs near the exercise area. That's normally where they hang out. So, if you're worried about encountering doggies, then just stay to the nature trail. It's the best way to kind of wander around, but they all seem pretty friendly. They just wanted to sniff. Although I did pick her up just in case. <laughs> yes, Eden, I seem to have become a bit more overprotective of you now, haven't I? <laughs> Never used to pick you up so soon. Yeah. How was that, Eden? Do you feel suitably walked? Yes, Daddy, thank you very much. I quite enjoyed it. I'm done. Take me back to my car. Okay, you're back in your car now. Let's get you some water. I think Grandad wants some water as well, doesn't he? Let's get him one of his drinks. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Ooh, nice. Nice and cold. Whew, even though it's almost quarter to five or something, I'm super hot. The sunlight is beaming. We are going to get some food now, I think. I'm not sure where I can take Eden, restaurant-wise, so we may have to take her back. I'm not sure. We just came down to the quiet end of Chatham Beach, south side, to see what it looks like. It's basically exactly the same, just with less shops. There's still quite a fair amount of street dogs about though, just kind of resting on the beach. So if I'm going to come here, I'll wait until Sasha's back. Okay, back to the main road. Interesting. We've just stopped off to have a look at these buildings. Dad's interested in the fact that they're made out of containers. I like the way they've set, set it separate. Yeah. You know, it's, uh, it's not one on top of the other. It's nicely done. <laughs> How are you doing back there, puppy? Not bad, Daddy, but now I would like some dinner, please. Dinner time! Get 
get some light in here. It's quite a dark house. Yeah. And one more, the special light. Ta -da! Okay, it's time to prepare Eden's little dinner treat and then we can eat our own food later. Oh, I'm cooking Eden a little chicken cake for a cake. A little surprise for her as well. All right, the chickens are out. It's time to construct Eden's food. All right, check out this construction I've made. Eden has a chicken breast heart with rabbit treats stuffed inside, a couple of extra bits and a candle. What do you think of that, Eden? I have not seen it yet. It's up on the table and I cannot get up there. This is one hell of a bad light, sir. Happy 11th birthday, Eden. Do you want to blow it out? Try to blow it out with your nose. I don't think you're capable of this. Pop. Enjoy. <laughs> She's pulled the whole thing out of her bowl. Do you want me to cut it into pieces for you? Yes, Daddy. She's far too big for my mate. All right, Eden's food has been deconstructed, ready for round two. Enjoy. Delicious. Oh, I'm quite pleased that Eden's enjoying her birthday dinner. 11 years old, hopefully we'll have many more years left with Eden to enjoy. I'm going to end the video here, please hit the thumbs up if you liked it, consider hitting the orange button if you want to do that, subscribe and we will see you next time. Bye. Oh my god, my dinner is already eaten. Hey dad, you got any more treats for me because it is still my birthday and I have finished my food. I could give you some more chicken to be honest because I've got some left over, but I was going to eat that. Because Daddy needs protein too. Yes, but it, it, it's my birthday, so I think I should get some more chicken breast. It's my favourite. Is that so? Is it really your favourite? Well, yes, you know this because that's why you gave it to me. This is true, Eden. Okay, you've convinced me. You can have more chicken breast. Yeah. Bye.